When we drove on this ranch, we knew we had discovered a very special place. I don't think Jim and I have ever been more aware of the beauty of nature than we have when we are in this place. It's just been an amazing part of our whole family life. It was a, a done deal. It was a beautiful place. There's just so many things that make this place unique. It's the mountains, it's the soils. We have pretty much a range of microclimates here. Starland Vineyard goes from about 750 feet above sea level to about 1,550 feet above sea level. And what this does is it promotes a lot of diversity within our Cabernet or Merlot or Cab Franc, which gives us a lot of different colors to paint whatever picture we think is best suited to representing Starland. For me, making great wine is about having great sites and great people. What I love about the winery is how it was designed to allow us to capture what we're discovering in the vineyards. And it was also designed to minimize the handling of our fruit and of the wine to preserve the expression of the purity of our fruit. The energy of, of harvest is like, it, it's almost like a constant buzz. There's a hum, there's a skip in people's steps, particularly once the ferments start to permeate the cellar and the aromas start to intoxicate the whole place. Uh, you just feel people wanting to be a part of what's going on uh, inside that fermenter. You know, in the end, you get to look back and you get to taste and touch and feel what you did. And it's not just what I did, it's what, what everyone who participated did. You know, it has to be a family project that everybody's interested in. They have to be sincere for us to obtain the excellence that we really want. Our core wines here at Star Lane are Cabernet, and then we do Sauvignon Blanc also. When you combine the quality of our wines and this incredibly planted vineyard, we're really thrilled with what we've already discovered, but I can't wait to see what else emerges in terms of the character of the fruit and the wines. We're trying to do every small thing we can to make each wine more and more special. The Deerberg family have a long tradition in American wine, having made wine in Missouri for a long time. And they also have a very pioneering spirit, which landed them in the Happy Canyon area of Santa Barbara. I think one thing that's attractive about the Star Lane Vineyard and the Deerberg family, for them it's a lot more than just making a great wine. It's about preserving this site and how special it is. There's something magical about this place, and I think the Deerberg sensed it, and they want to preserve it. Well, we have a 250-year plant here, and we're very serious about it. Jim Deerberg started this project with a 250-year plan in mind, and he really has the patience uh, to want to see uh, greatness achieved. And when you're in a state vineyard, you have the opportunity to learn more about your vineyard and your wines than anybody else. When you have the long-term vision that the family has, you want to be a part of something that transcends yourself. I think you have to adopt the belief that great wines are discovered and not made. And as a result, it makes the future very promising because you're engaged on this path where you're going to continue to discover what makes your wines and your sites great.